weekend. Uh, it's at the State House, uh, and we will be walking a couple miles. Uh, if any of your local church kids ask you to sponsor, I would, in I would encourage you to do so. And daylight savings time ends on Sunday. Turn your clocks back one hour, or you will be early to church. What time is Walmart? Uh, I have to be there at 11. I, we don't really are going to get going until about 12, 12 or 1. But it's uh, it's for a good cause. It's for hunger issues here, not only here but internationally. So, because we're doing this with church world services. And Mary Louise, some of the people weren't here a few weeks ago when you gave your update. But you had a what 29 percent increase year over year. Uh, over the first quarter of and actually, I just ran the first quarter of this year versus first quarter of last year, and we're like at about, uh, about a 25 percent increase in families that we're seeing. Uh, we are taking budget cuts. We're uh, no different than any other organization. We're downsizing and reorganizing. Uh, but our busiest season is about to happen with, with, Chris, with the Christmas and Thanksgiving season. Uh, we will see lines out to the road, both at Shop Road and uh, at the Casey Pantry. Uh, and I have to... Uh, give the uh, Capital City Republican women credit. They are going, at their Christmas party, they're going to be doing a, uh, a fundraiser for uh, two charities, and people can donate. And one of them is fortunately Harvest Hope, so I wanted to thank them. Thank you. And if you're visiting South Carolina, drop by the Shawnee's Restaurant on Airport Boulevard here in Casey, South Carolina. Until next week, Steve Eisen signing off. Thanks.